Okay, this is a tutorial on how to save multiple JPEG files into one single PDF file. So these are JPEG images and I will insert them into one single PDF file using Microsoft Word 2010. So it's Word 2010. Okay, so Word is here. Let's bring it to the left and select all of the JPEG files and drag the JPEGs into Microsoft Word. Drop them there. Okay, and now let's analyze it a little bit. Let's zoom out. Okay, so we have three pages and each page has two pictures, two JPEGs. So we should, first of all, let's see, change the orientation of the page. So the pictures are on horizontal and the page itself is on vertical. So let's go to page layout, orientation, and change it to landscape. Page, la page layout, orientation, and landscape. Okay, now we should increase the size of the picture, but before that let's get rid of this portion, this one, so we will push the image into the upper left corner. To do that, let's go to margins here at page layout, margins and custom margins. Okay, now the top, bottom, left and right should be set to zero. Top zero, bottom zero, right zero and left zero. Close it with OK. Now we eliminated the left part and the top part, that white area. Now we should grab, select an image and grab the corner and drag it to the side of the page somewhere there okay now that we made the image larger it pushed out the next image let's double click this image that goes to format and here's the width and the height of that picture let's select for example the height and copy that height. Let's go to the next picture and paste in the same height here and press enter. Okay, let's do the same thing with the rest of the images. Paste in, press enter. Okay, it might not cooperate. It's not accepting the value. It's jumping back to the last value okay so the, in this case select that image and let's go to the lower right corner click on that arrow and introduce the height here and funny but it's working this way okay so that's done let's select the next one let's go directly there so the program won't refuse the new height Okay, let's go down, select the last page, the down, that small little arrow, paste in the new height, select the last image, that small arrow and the new height, paste it in. Okay, now we should get rid of this white portion also. So basically we should make the page size the same as the picture size. So let's click on the picture and let's see the height. It's this one that we just used. Copy that one. Now go to page layout and margins, custom margins. No, sorry, not margins. Size. So page layout size, more paper sizes, and the same height. Paste in the height of the picture 
to the height of the page and click OK. And now the white margin has disappeared. Okay, maybe there's something on the right side. Okay, whatever, you can modify that if you want. Now let's go to File, Save As, and let's place it on the C, C drive, and save as type PDF. Make sure you are selecting PDF, and click on a Save. Now Word is saving the document into a PDF file and it already opened it using Adobe Reader and here are the six pictures that we just took and there are inside a PDF file. Okay, let's see the C drive, one single PDF file and it contains the pictures. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching and bye-bye.